Snow White and the seven magical forest creatures. Not content with losing $900 million on their last eight releases, Disney is aiming to make it a nice round billion with their latest live action remake that absolutely no one asked for. And who to play Snow White? A German princess who, according to the original Brothers Grimm fairy tale, was the fairest one of all and had skin as white as snow. The Hispanic brown woman. I saw the logo and I went, that's my name, Snow White's up there, and I cried my eyes out. And who to play the seven dwarfs? A diverse mix of genders, ethnicities, and height, six of whom aren't even dwarfs. And embarking on the production of this farce, Disney walked on enough eggshells to carpet a football field ten times over. The story has been criticised as being ableist for portraying the dwarfs with lesser intelligence and Snow White seeing them as children. Right, so Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs is ableist. So in the name of better representation for underprivileged communities, you decided to deprive seven potential dwarfism sufferers of work, instead handing the prominent roles to six able-bodied people. Could anything be more ableist? To avoid reinforcing stereotypes from the original animated film, we are taking a different approach with these seven characters and have been consulting with members of the dwarfism community. Right, so to eliminate the stereotype, you just eliminated the dwarfs altogether. You can't even call them dwarves anymore because that's ableist. So now nearly all of them aren't even dwarfs and they're called magical forest creatures. And what of Prince Charming waking Snow White from her slumber with a kiss? I don't think so. That's toxic masculinity and he's been eradicated too. Co-written by Barbie's Greta Gerwig, the upcoming adaptation will not feature a Prince Charming and will instead focus on a stronger Snow White who dreams of becoming a leader. More pretentious girl boss cringe than a guaranteed theatre a failure every single time. Another example of a beloved franchise being rinsed through a politically correct purity filter and ruined for the next generation. Rachel Zegler, who plays the fictional princess, said people are making these jokes about ours being the PC Snow White. Yeah, it is, because it needed that. Really? Can't wait to see those opening weekend box office figures when the question of if anyone needed or wanted this will, I confidently predict, be vehemently answered. Which begs another question. If you're that nervous over a remake of Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs, to the extent that virtually everything about it is so far removed from the original as to be unrecognisable. Why even bother in the first place? Get early access to videos, exclusive live streams and personally DM me. You've seen how much I get demonetized all the time. Well, this is how you support me. By subscribing at pauljosephwatson.locals.com. Please click the link in the description.